this is the camera I use at the minute for recording, uh, photographs, everything. This is a Sony NEX5N and this is by far the most varied camera for doing near enough everything you would like to do with the camera in one place. This is absolutely epic in every sense, apart from the fact of course you cannot charge this by USB. It's a very nice looking camera, it's got a nice lens cap like that, it doesn't look quite right without it to be honest. So you just put that on, and sorry if it's a bit dirty, it just need a clean, I, um, I do work outdoors and stuff. Um, I've not got a bad thing to say about this. Uh, apart from the menu section, but that's just one thing that everybody has the trouble with with these cameras. I'm fairly used to it now, the um, the settings on this camera. But then again, I keep discovering lots of new things and features uh, in the actual settings menu itself. And then even things on the settings menu has a settings menu for that setting. Um, the screen itself, you can tilt up and out and any way you like which is quite convenient if you're going up something like a chimney I don't know why you would that's just what comes to my mind or if you're looking down a building or something that's probably more than likely what you'd be doing uh, you can hold it like that or if you're at a protest or something and you hold it above the crowd you can hold it above the crowd and still be able to see the screen above you it's a very nice camera uh, the file formats are quite big. I only have 8 gigabyte cards in these, but I have two cards. So, just in case they bugger up, because the files are very complex on these cameras. Uh, especially in RAW format, I always shoot in picture mode j with JPEGs. Uh, just for the convenience of uploading to Facebook, YouTube, etc, etc. It's very well... Uh, well... Yeah, it's nothing more to say about this camera really. It's done a good job for me and I rate it over any DSLR or any compact camera because of course it is a mixture of the two. This is the video quality of the Sony NEX5N 16.1 megapixel camera. This is a brilliant camera and I don't need to do all this because I use it all the time and at 50 frames a second or even 25 or 30 frames a second you're not going to beat the image quality for the money you pay for this camera this camera cost me 170 or yeah 170 pounds say in the United Kingdom and it's a relatively old camera now being about three or four years old but I love it, it is absolutely brilliant plus I can see myself in the lens so I know what I'm looking like uh, and who I'm talking to.